Hi guys! Today we'll be weighing our coil legs. Um, we thought we'll do an experiment on um, how much weights will be lost during incub incubation. So we'll weigh um, the eggs now and then we'll wait till they hatch and weigh the chicks. Um, we only have four eggs that were just laid today. Um, so let's get started. Okay, the first one. 11 grams. Ten. Eleven. I wish I had a better weighing scale that can display at least one decimal place. But that works too. Oh, this one's slightly lighter. I'm probably not gonna hash this one. Wait, what's going on? Nine. Meh. Might as well put it in. Okay. I should have done this um, a few days ago before I put those eggs into the incubator. Um, now that they're already in, I don't think it's accurate anymore to take them out and weigh how heavy they are. Um, but I think 10 or 11 grams per egg is the average. So let's wait till they all hatch and um, see how heavy the newly borns are. Today is day 16 and I can already see some of them starting to move and wiggle a little, a little bit. I um, actually just uh, candled them a few hours ago. They've already internally pipped. Most of them have. Uh, and um, so that means I can expect them to hatch tomorrow. Today's day 17. And this little guy over here has just externally I'm zipped and is ready to hatch out. And you can see that it's a white one. Okay, so we hatched nine chicks over three days, five white chicks and four um, striped ones, and um, they've been doing pretty well so far. And just for fun, we thought we're just gonna weight them on our weighing scale, electronic weighing scale. Um, as you can see, this one just hatched out a couple of hours ago, still adjusting, still drying out. Um, the bigger ones, this guy and this one, As you can see their wings are starting to mature already, see over there, she's really sleepy, um, yeah, so let's get started, see how heavy they are. Start with the um, older ones. Okay. There we go. Ooh. Eleven grams. Thanks for your cooperation. Back home. Next one. Ooh. 
13 grams. All right, fun fact, she's been eating like crazy like every single minute for the past three days. And that explains it. Fatty, fatty. Ta-da! As I was saying, she's been eating non-stop for the past three days. And she's been pooping as well, non-stop. Okay, I just cleaned my weighing scale. Um, by the way, if you notice I kept using the word she, that doesn't mean that I know their gender, because they're still so young. Um, but interestingly, so far I've hatched 30 plus chicks, and all of them um, are females. If anyone cares to explain why, happy to hear. So yeah, I'm used to using the word she. Anyway. Here we go. This is the only black one that we hatched three days ago. Let's see how heavy, how heavy she is. No, that can't be right. Hold on. Oh, it is right. Jeez. Okay. 16 grams. Wow. Um, which one do we go next? I hope I remember. Okay, let's take out all the black ones. So that okay, these three, one by one. Um, am I getting it correct? No. Oh yes, correct. Right. Okay, number four. Here we go. Ooh, oops. Stand still. Oh, naughty. Yo. Nine grams. Two days old. Nine grams. Two days old. Number two. Come back. Hmm. She's really curious. Oh no 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 no. Ten grams. Wow. Ten grams in two days. Oh, Eleven. Now oh, she's as heavy as a three-day-old chick. Try again. Oh, okay, never mind. She doesn't want to cooperate. Number three, two days old. Eight grams. So you really can't tell their weight by just looking at how big they are. They might have been eating a lot in their stomach and you just can't tell and drinking a lot. Okay, now the three youngest ones that just catch up this morning. Ooh, so small. Six. Number two. Seven. And this one seems to have a little bit of issue with her legs. Um, some curled toes, but she should be okay in a couple of hours. Five only, wow. She hasn't started eating or drinking at all yet, so... I should be fine. Okay. That's all my six chicks. <laughs>